My father taught me not to take things for granted and I realised that with the company I work for and the people that I work with, um, just how lucky I am. We manufacture the finest artist acrylics in the world uh, and have been doing so since the early 1960s. One thing that sets us apart from other manufacturers is that we actually listen to our customers, get ideas from our customers and like to innovate and try using and making different products. Our process of manufacture begins with sourcing the raw materials that we use, especially the pigments to get the right colours, the colours that we're after. We take these pigments, we grind them, we mix them with the acrylic. Once that's done, and we check obviously the quality against the standard, and then we fill those products into tubes or jars. We don't add extra gloss. We leave them fairly matte, because to try and matte a glossy paint down means that you'll dull the intensity of the colour. We don't put any masking agents in our paints. Uh, we don't put any perfumes to make them smell nice. Mainly so kids don't get hold of them and think they're something nice to eat. Uh, nowadays everyone has environmental and social responsibility programs in place. Uh, but at Derriman we actually live them. We donate 10% of our net profit each year to charities and schools. So the recycling really starts with reusing, which is the most energy efficient way of uh, recycling, with our customers returning certain packaging to us that we can then reuse. And we, we run a program where they run a prize and get a bike so they can ride to work. We recycle our own water by cleaning it and reusing it, and it's reused to cool machines and that sort of thing. Our building is sited such that we make use of cross breezes and we actually don't have any air conditioning. Light, uh, once again, the building is sited such that we use less lighting in this building than we did in the previous one and the previous one was less than half the size. Work-life balance is important for both myself but also my staff. We manage that with various things that we do with them. It's, it's not so much a program because it's a one-on-one -on -one basis. The same, I try and sort of have the same philosophy myself with involving the kids and being involved with what they do, being involved uh, with their schools and, and, and uh, you know, working bees and things like that, playing sport with them and all the usual things that parents, you know, attempt to do. We try and make sure that happens all through our organisation with our staff um, so that they get to spend time with their families as well. I believe that our staff should go home the same way or as healthy as they came in in the morning, uh, sometimes even better. When asked what the philosophy is in the way we make our paint, my primary answer would be to make the most intense, strongest colours that we are able to, with, with, with the, the highest pigment content and cleanest colour. That's the overall ruling factor. Make the colour as strong as possible and as intense as possible. All my life I've been surrounded by art and colour. I was born to work in this company. I'm a practicing artist, although with a young family and uh, running the business, I don't get that much time to practice anymore. But I do get every day to play with color, uh, work with color and paint, and I wouldn't have it any other way. <laughs>